Hey, it's Spoon Phillips out of Maury's Music in Coldale, Pennsylvania. I came all this way from Brooklyn, New York to check out this really special Martin guitar that I've heard a lot about for a long time, and I now finally get to see one and have it in my hands. This is the Martin Double O L Earth. Double O is the body size. The L stands for the long double O, which is a 1930s looking uh, body shape with sloped shoulders, though it's still a 14 fret guitar. So it has the sloped shoulders of an old timey 12 fret, but with a 14 fret neck, um, which gives it a little extra oomph in the bottom end and the low mids. And that works really well when a guitar is made with a species of wood from the mahogany family. Back and sides of this are solid African sapeli, or sapeli, as some people say, from the mahogany family, uh, a traditional tone wood that's been used for guitars and other musical instruments for uh, a couple of centuries now. And it uh, looks a lot like Cuban mahogany uh, because it has these wonderful straight coppery bands running through the... Uh, the, the uh, you'll see that on the back of this guitar and on a lots and lots of Sapelli guitars. It's got a very comfortable Martin High Performance neck, short scale neck, meaning the frets are a little closer together, uh, the hands a little closer to the body, and more play and pliability in the strings because of the shorter uh, scale, less string tension, really good for bluesy playing, lead guitar playing. The back is Martin's modified low oval profile. It's got the high performance taper to the neck, so one and three quarter inch down here at the nuts, but only two and an eighth here. So still slender. The fingerboard and the bridge are made from FSC certified solid ebony. The buttons, uh, position markers, the dots are made from Sapelli. Really cool wood markers. I just love that. This guitar is 100% plastic free. The finish on it is environmentally friendly. It's very thin, one coat. You can feel the grain of the wood. Really magnificent vintage style tuners. You know, and I guess I should finally talk about the elephant in the room. This spectacular reproduction of a painting by the famous artist Robert Getzel, who uh, is uh, a friend of Moray's music, you could say. Robert's done a lot of artwork for C.F. Martin, but how about this magnificent, magnificent tribute to our home planet with a beautiful sunrise coming up over, and here you have Greenland and the beginning of North America under the clouds. Really just gorgeous, and you can see the eastern forests up through Canada. Beautiful, beautiful blue sea in what... Uh, the late Carl Sagan called our pale blue dot out there in space. Just what a marvelous, marvelous piece of uh, Martin guitar history uh, and uh, living history. And, uh, and I love how it sounds. Just listen to how this sustains and how open and bringing this is. Just uh, angelic.